Welcome to Some Good Local Government News by the Alliance for Innovation. That's S-G-L-G-N by AFI, because acronyms are how we make this legit. We're sharing good news stories from local governments from around the world, because we could all use a little good news these days. Plus, John Krasinski had this really good idea, and he said he even wouldn't sue us if we borrowed it. Go ahead and Google it. I'm Kim Newcomer. Let's get started. Here's the thing, friends. The days of local government as we knew it are over. You can't go back. So even as you work through the really tough stuff, reopening, budget cuts, layoffs, we have to look beyond returning to normal. I think it's time to take a cue from those on the front lines and expand. No, better yet, reimagine what local government can be. Let's start in Ontario, California. And let me ask you this, what would you do if you saw two young graduates taking photos on their front lawn? Break into a Whitney Houston song. I knew you were going to say that. It's so obvious. This city of Ontario integrated waste employee, Bruce, saw an opportunity to make graduation day special despite stupid COVID-19. When he saw these two taking pictures, he socially distanced, serenaded them with, you guessed it, the greatest love of all. He not only left them with a song, but with encouragement born from his own tragedy. He's authentic, he's empathetic, it's inspirational. I'm not crying, you're crying. I believe that children are future. Teach them well and let them be the way. Thanks to at JadenXG on Twitter for sharing. Now let's head to Kansas. Everyone loves firefighters, but for the Olathe, Kansas Fire Department, that apparently isn't good enough. If they're not out delivering personal hygiene kits to locals in need, they've been teaching people how to cook. Yeah, that's right. They save lives and they cook. And I'm sitting at a desk right now considering ordering takeout. But fear not, they're willing to share their knowledge through their Food at the Firehouse video series. They're showing us how to whip up delicious firehouse cuisine in minutes. We want to test it. Like we talked about in previous episodes, is we want to test all of our food to make sure that it's seasoned well and it's cooked well. Before we wrap up today with a little news from the weird, you should know that Some Good Local Government News is a production of Slate Communications, a public relations and marketing company exclusively serving local government. Check us out at slatecommunications.com. Now friends, let's talk about what in the world is going on in Singapore. To help enforce six feet of social distance in between park goers, Singapore has deployed robot dogs. Yes, robot dogs. They've, they've managed to take the one thing that everyone loves and turn them into a genuinely disturbing and yet amazingly effective tool to help keep us safe. Plus, they're using these adorable metal versions of man's best friend to get an accurate count of how many people are using the park each day. So, you know, next time your kid asks you for a pandemic puppy, you can just plug in the Roomba and call it good. That's all for this week, everyone. We'll see you next time.